the vulnerability or the susceptibility to the infection is more in pregnant women if they are in the third trimester that is the fat end of their pregnancy or if they have pre-existing medical conditions. People ask, should I uh, do an MTP around the, this time because it is COVID uh, reason. So there's no need. According to uh, uh, the WHO or uh, the other fertility societies, they have permitted to uh, go through all the fertility treatments. The vulnerability or the susceptibility to the infection is more in pregnant women if they are in the third trimester, that is the fat end of their pregnancy, or if they have pre-existing medical conditions like diabetes, hypertension or high BP, or pre-existing kidney disease, or overweight or obese. Age matters, so about 35, they are susceptible to the virus. First trimester is mostly managed, second trimester also managed through telemedicine. We can schedule maybe a two months once visit to check their BP and vital checks for a scan can be done. The third trimester of course uh, visits cannot be avoided because every two weeks checkup is in, uh, mandatory. Before delivery yes, the last two to three weeks every weekly checkups is advised. We are giving a one hour a gap between two pregnant patients, but if in a busy clinic, at least half an hour difference is there. So that shouldn't be a problem. According to studies and according to all the previous researches done in China and UK, there is no vertical transmission between the mother and baby. It cannot be transmitted to the amniotic fluid or the blood to the baby. Babies have to have been tested positive after delivery, that is maybe because they were in contact with the mother or contact with the healthcare personnel. During the labor process, the shortness of breath, the dyspnea increases and there is a high risk of transmission to the healthcare personnel also. So to cut short labor, caesarean delivery is uh, advisable, immediate delivery of the baby and the baby is separated from the mother. Breastfeeding is not avoided because there is no uh, evidence of transmission through the breast milk to the baby. The mother has to wear the protective equipment and then only feed the baby. After breastfeeding is done, the baby has to be distanced from the mother. It is at least six meters distance should be there. A hand washing, uh, washing the face and immediately changing the towels and immediately changing her clothes and the clothes of the baby is very, very important. Miscarriage rate in the first trimester, second trimester, it's not more. And even the third trimester, many COVID, even COVID positive women have delivered a term at the day, expected date of delivery and have, they have delivered healthy infants. With over one lakh medical experts and the facility to teleconsult, experience clinic-like consultations on practice.